Hi everyone, this is Christine and today I'm going to show you how to make overlapping transparent shapes. The overlapping looks a lot prettier when the shapes have a little bit of see-through on them. So we're going to show you that. I picked some nice vibrant colors ahead of time, so let's get started. Okay, so I kind of found these colors in advance, but the one thing we have to add is an opacity of 0 0.8. So you still have that nice vibrant color, except there's a little bit of ability to see through the shape when they overlap. Okay, so let's, so we have five colors. And these are what we call quartuples, or they're also called fourteples. We import the turtle module for our drawing. Oops. For turtle object. And of course, hide the turtle. We don't need to see the turtle. Okay. After that, I'm going to put all of these lovely colors into a list. She uses this bracket. And I don't need quotes around them because they're variables. And I just put all the colors I just wrote down in my list of culls. You can write colors if you like. Now, at this point, I'm going to have a loop inside of a loop. But before anything, let me get my pen in the right position. I'm going to put the pen up. Go to the point negative 25, negative 25. That's a pretty nice point to go to. And then have my pen down and ready to go. So now let's begin our outer loop. For I in range five, because I'm going to have five shapes going around. Okay, well, first thing we're going to do is choose the fill color. And the fill color is going to be the entry from the list. So we're going to say it's calls. And each time I changes, the color changes. So we'll say calls I with an index of I. And we're also going to begin the fill. Otherwise, you'll have no color. Now, we're ready to start our inner loop, which makes the shape. For I in range, we're making hexagons, so I'm going to do a range of six. I'm going to make each side 50. And I'm going to turn left 60. And you're probably wondering why. Because the angles are 120 degrees in a hexagon. Well, we're going to turn left the exterior angle, which is 360 divided by the six sides. And that gives you 60. Okay. So after that, we are going to end our fill. And make a turn. We're doing five shapes, so we need to turn. Uh, sorry, we need to go left. 72. And let me show you where I get my 72 from. 
360 divided by 5, the exterior angle again, 72. So let's see, we have our begin fill, our end fill, we changed our color, we put our position. I think we're in good shape. Let's let it rip. That looks really nice. So I hope you enjoyed seeing this video and I hope you got something out of it. And thank you for watching and everybody enjoy your day and be healthy.